I survived 100 days in LEGO Fortnite. Huge thank you to Epic Games for sponsoring this video. LEGO Fortnite is a brand new survival and sandbox game that has building, adventure, crafting, and a lot more. In this video, it's my goal to build up a thriving LEGO village, craft up various gear and items, and to defeat one of the final bosses in the game. This is a really fun new survival experience, so I hope you enjoy the video. You can check out LEGO Fortnite now using the link in my description. Other than that, everybody enjoy! Honestly, I'm really excited to play this. First, we have to do the most important thing, which is picking our outfit. Look at the sheer amount of new outfits they've basically added. All right, let's go with Raven. And now that, uh, you know, the most important thing is done, let's select world. Let's start it up and let's go for it. Ooh, here we go. We're spawning in. Wow, look at this. Oh, hello. Talk to Cuddle Team Leader. Where am I? Who are you? Who am I? Wait, I know that last one. My name's Cuddle Team Leader. Nice to meet you. I've never fallen into a brand new place like this before, but I'm glad we fell together. It could be dangerous out there. We should prepare ourselves just in case. Should I just say bye? I don't know. Prepare. Here we go. It seems like there's a lot of wood and gray night around here. I wonder what we can make with them. Wait, can I hit this tree? No. I guess I have to pick up scraps. Pumpkin. Thank you. You are hungry? What are you talking about? Oh, okay. Wait. If I press three, I can eat that up. There we go. Wood. Okay, it looks like when you break the bushes, you get a lot of items. Oh, there we go. Granite. There it is. It's these little rocks. I feel like those resources are going to come in handy. A toasty campfire will keep things bright and warm. We should build one just in case. Here we go. Build. Q. Boom. Campfire. Look at that. And then also simple shack. Um, you can also rotate it. Oh, look at that. Okay, then we'll put this like right there. Bam. Shack pillar. Oh, so you have to put them in place yourself. I see. Bam. Built. I think I did it. Your campfire will keep us warm if things get too cold. And if we get lost while adventuring, we can look for the smoke signal to get back to camp. I'm getting pretty tired of collecting rocks and sticks the old-fashioned way. If we had a crafting bench, we could make some tools. I'm on it. Village square. Establishes a village in the surrounding area. Interesting. I like that. Okay, we need more wood. So let me collect some of that. Crafting bench gives me so many ideas for new inventions like tools. Do you think we are the only people that rifted here? Maybe we should build something like a village square. Okay. Oh, and it's nighttime because I had to step away for a second. Well, you know what? That works. Okay, so we have to craft some tools. Forest axe, a basic stone axe, perfect for harvesting trees or for self-defense. Boom. Oh, take that. <laughs> okay, pickaxe and torches. We need those. If we upgraded the crafting bench, we might be able to make better tools, a stronger tool will last longer and break even more things. So we need planks and shells. Okay. We can make a bed. Um, I kind of wish we could have put our bed under the shelter. Here we go. We can kind of put it to the side. I'm sleeping. Oh, but see, it's not making it turn into daytime, is it? I can mine some of these rocks finally. And now we should be able to build the village square. I'll just place that there. Ooh, I get to choose a color. Of course, I'm going to do purple. An icon. There we go. Fortress. That's a bit threatening to others that want to approach us. So look at that. Friendly explorers will visit the village. Growing village. An additional villager can live at this village. Let's do that because it would be awesome to have people helping us out. Oh, what is that? What is this? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey, hey, what is this thing? Do I have to like sneak up on it? Can I not catch up to this thing? I don't know how it works. Oh, apparently I can't go in the water because, okay. Ow. Oh, oh my goodness. Ow. I le I'm leaving. I'm leaving. It's following me. Oh no. I have to fight this thing. I don't know how. Okay, you just have to dodge and attack. Dodge. Attack. Oh, I got it. Oh, I can't believe I just got it. And I can check my map, which is cool because it looks like it shows where my home is. And look at that. Let's see. Village upgrade. Boom. Oh, here we go. Talk to Sunflower. Hey there, I'm Sunflower. You can find me out in the fields. I think I'll stop at your village for the night. Very cool. Okay, so that's our first villager. What's the next step in our journey? I live in my village. But your village doesn't meet my needs. Excuse me. Okay, we need a bed. Roomy shack or log shed? Roomy shack. We want a roomy shack. Boom. Start build. 
Boom, roomy shack complete, awesome. Boom bed, we can talk to Sunflower here. Live in my village. Yes, make yourself at home. There we go, so we have a new villager, awesome. I'd kind of like to do a better job of managing our space here, because I don't want everything to be all over the place. So can we expand this by any chance? I wonder. Okay, how about this? I'm gonna build a roomy shack next to this one, kinda. Boom. And you know what? If uh, things aren't perfect right now, that's fine, because I'm still trying to figure out what the best way to build things is. Oh, and I'm out of wood again. All right, well. Bam, roomy shack complete. So lumber mill, we can put this here. So we needed planks, for example, and we can say how many we want. So let's do like 20 for now. While we're waiting for that, we also need a spinning wheel and probably a grill too, for which I need even more resources. Oh, also look at that. Our village upgrade is ready. Yes, yeah, so we just need granite and plank. Can we mine this? No. Oh, but there's a little entrance. Look at this. No way. Did we find a cave? Enter. Oh, I'm entering. Oh, here's a chest. Search. Snowberry gives you some kind of an effect. Blast powder, cord, arrows. Okay, wait. So we have to jump to that chest up here. I'm guessing we have to build something. Oh, I can jump on it as I build. Oh, perfect. <gasps> Look at that. I got marbles. I wonder if we can find any types of weapons here, because if we can't, I might have to leave right away. Oh, and my axe is broken. Yeah, I'm officially struggling here. Oh, gotcha. Whoa, 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 what is that thing? No, 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 no. Can I make a crafting bench while I'm out here? Oh, <gasps> I can. And I can make a short sword, but I don't have the materials. Also a shield. Oh, look at that. Okay, another chest here. Wool, marble, stuff like that. Okay, I'm running low on inventory. Oh, I'm trying to build away from them. Ow, how is he still hitting me? Get me out. All right. Okay, what? Oh, my goodness. Okay, you know what? I'm just going to go grab my stuff right now. There's another chest. Oh, why not? Oh, boy. Oh, my God. I died again. Are you kidding me? Okay, you know what? Before we get our stuff back, given that it doesn't despawn, let us try to gear back up and even craft the short sword and shield because uh, you know what, that'll help out a lot. In that case, it's time to get some basic materials all over again, so let's do it. Okay, I'm gonna make another ax and shovel. I can take the planks we made and I can actually, oh, I can't craft a sword. We need wooden rods, okay. In that case, I'm gonna make some wooden rods. And for the shield, we need a cord, but I don't have the materials for that yet. So we're gonna skip on the shield. Okay, and with those, I should be able to craft a short sword. Let's head towards the cave and grab food on our way. Okay, I'm back, it's time. We're gonna get our stuff back, 100% chance. Oh, this is it right here. Look at that. We just dropped all my items on the floor. We kind of got to choose what we want to keep and what we don't want to keep, I guess. I want this snowberry thing because it's glowing blue. Oh boy. Ow. I'm not having this happen again. I want to leave. I want to leave. I just want my stuff and I'm leaving. Here we go. This should be the exit, thankfully. Okie dokie. Let's get back to our home. Hello, Raptor. We're just gonna have to like stack the beds. I don't know how everybody's gonna feel about that, but that's what I'm doing right now. And uh, let's try to bring these guys into our village. It's nice to stay somewhere, but your village seems crowded. Improve your village level, wow. Luckily I can do that because we made the pieces of plank that we needed. Let's see if this guy is willing to join now. Perfect. And now we can finally upgrade our crafting bench. We can make some better tools already. Forest axe, but it's uncommon quality instead. And bam chest. Perfect. We can deposit a bunch of items. Good, good, good. Okay, let's see. We probably want to make a stone breaker, spinning wheel, so we need all these different things. I guess I can try to fit one more in here, possibly. Let's see. Uh... And with that, we can make some pretty important things, it looks like. I'm looking at some lighting options, and to make a bulb, you need copper. So it looks like we are going to need to mine in these caves, I guess, for some copper. Adding some lighting. 
Oh, and now I can village upgrade. Perfect. Okay, let's see what I need. Not root, a sturdy wood found in caves, plank, and granite. Okay, well, let's make some tools. And it looks like I can also make a shield right now if we want. So I'm gonna make some planks. Boom, shield, and we got one, perfect. Okay, I feel a lot more prepared to head into a cave here. Let's see what we got going on. Oh, my sword broke. Oh, that's not ideal, is it now? Yeah, I can't even mine any of this, okay. Maybe I need the upgraded tools to do so. Okay, I think I just went out of a different exit. So this is the one, yeah, that brings us further from home. But the plus of that is maybe on the way back while discovering this area, we can find something else that's new. I also see something glowing over there. Oh, hello. Oh, I didn't want to fight. All right, fine. Oh, there's a chest here. Oh, how am I going to eat? Okay, eat, 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 eat. Oh, yes. Good. Have they regenerated their health? No, they haven't. Got you. Awesome. Oh, we took everybody out. Chest. And fairly simple loot, actually, but I'll take it. Well, that was an interesting little find. Let's continue along. Let's see. I'm going to place another chest. Boom. And we definitely need that. Oh, okay. Wait. And look at that. I can get uh, sunflower to up the village. Resource jobs. Uh, let's see. Collect nearby resources. It will take me about one day of exploration to find something useful. Okay. Can I do the same with Raptor? I can. Help the village. Resource jobs. Refine wood. Good. Everybody's getting to work around here. How cool is that? Oh, okay. This time I'm going to follow this because I've recently seen that this leads you to something special, which I'm not going to spoil just yet. Oh, that's not what I thought it would be. I thought it would be a loot llama, actually, but that works too. There's another chest over here. Thank you. Whoa, I just picked up this random box. I'm sticking with it. I don't know what this is, but I'm taking it home. Boop. Let's see here. We might be able to make this health charm, actually. We just need silk thread. So let's make a couple of those, I believe. Take. And we should be able to make this health charm. Look at that. Awesome. Oh, equipment. Bam. We can even make multiple, it seems. So I'd be tempted to do that. Let's make some more silk threads. Boom. There's another health charm. And yeah, I can equip that too. So now I have, what, seven hearts? Awesome. We can also make a shovel, an upgraded forest axe. And for the pickaxe, we need not root. I also have this recurve crossbow that I picked up, which I think I should just take because I do have a good amount of arrows. Ooh, here's like a golden looking chest with some guards around it. Let's take these fellas out. Goodbye. What have we got in here? Nothing crazy. Uh, wheat. Interesting. I'm hearing sounds coming from over here. Oh, yeah. There's somebody over there dancing. Oh, and there's a huge monster. Hold on, hold on. You know what we should do is get ready to build. Okay, let's try to build towards whatever this is. Okay, I'm not sure if I'll fall through this cloud or something, so hold on. Okay, I have no idea what's going on right now. Hello? Is this just an Easter egg? Dance. Oh, oh, plant in a garden plot to grow snowberries. I'm pretty sure that's really good. Okay, now I wonder if we can try to take out this monster from up here. Hold on, I need to make a staircase for us here. Okay, wait, I built stairs. Can I jump on them? Let me see if we can try to shoot this monster from up here now. I don't know if it's damaging it. And my crossbow broke, <laughs> but I tried. Let me dynamite it. Is that going to work? Come on. Wow, that barely did any damage. I'm running away. I think that's a good sign. Whoa, is that a supply drop? No way. What do we got? Slap juice. Interesting. Drink to heal and temporarily increase stamina regeneration for two minutes, it looks like. Whoa. Okay. Pumpkin seeds. We should grab those because we can start growing them. It looks like we need to start a farm. Here we go. I think this is a cave. Well, let's see what we can do here. There is a certain type of material we need to get. Oh, slurp mushroom. Oh, there we go. Not root. <laughs> That's the stuff we needed. Awesome. So I'm going to try to collect up more of that. Okay, and I can't break this with the regular axe. Okay, I think we need to return home. Ooh, I'm running low on inventory space. And then we can even go to the cave that's close to our base with the upgraded axe. And we should be able to do the same thing we did here. Okay. 
Okay, now I'm gathering some resources so I can build a log cabin. And I ran out of wood. And back to work. Boom, and uh, that is the log cabin completed. Now that we have this spacious room, we can start adding some stuff like uh, this closet. Oh yeah, perfect space right there. And I will also remove this bed. There we go. How you doing over here, Raptor? Uh, how's your job? Get plank, get one rod. You only got one? It's not very hard work. Oh, I just pressed let's explore with Cuddle Team Leader. Okay, looks like Cuddle Team Leader is going to explore with us. It also looks like we can upgrade when we want, but we need more knot root. So we should definitely head caving. Before I leave, I should definitely set down our bed. Boop. All we need before we head out is to make some more tools. I'm making some knot root rods here so we can make an upgraded pickaxe, but I'm also going to need some more base materials. Oh, I can give Cuddle Team Leader an axe. Hold on. Look at this. Boom. You're welcome. What is that there? Are you going to help me now? So now, Cuddle Team Leader just helps me with getting all of our wood. That's awesome. Let's pick up those not root rods and boom, pickaxe. Probably also make a default one or two. Okay, I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. Let's go. Okay, here we are. And we're just here for the not a root, really. And after we get some more of this, we should probably just start expanding more of our village. And also, I want to figure out how to grow those seeds we've been getting, because I feel like that might be important to sustainable progress. Ooh, looks like the chest is refreshed here. Slapberry. Slapberry seed. That's all new stuff. Also, I wonder if we can get the different stone variant here. Let's see. Marble. Oh, yeah. Okay. Perfect. All right. Well, now that we're back. Oh, hello. Uh, it's time to work on our village because obviously we have a lot of visitors and we're not keeping up with them whatsoever. Okay. Let's see. I'm going to get some design going on. An end table. Okay. We want to put this next to our bed, bedside. Displays. I can make that at least. Uh, cozy shelf. Oh, it looks like I can place it right there. Ooh, garden plot. Plant seeds inside and watch them grow. So we should do that. That's some farming stuff. And let's see what we can do. Boop, 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 boop. Let's start planting. And we can do different seeds and different ones. Wheat. Here we go. We got a couple more types. Okay, yeah, let's see. I think we should start building these, honestly. How hard is it to build? I might completely regret this. Oh, boy. I'm already regretting it with how hard it is to build one single wall. Interesting. Maybe you can extend these walls. Yeah, just by using this, for example. And then you can lock it into place. So you circle it around. Boop, like that. Oh, hold on. The rainbow thing. Come here. Come here, rainbow thing. Oh, and it looks like it's led us to a random chest. With enemies here, are you kidding me? All right, nothing we need very much from there. So I'll just head back. Okay, I'm trying to build this way. And unfortunately, it uh, doesn't seem very easy. Um, I'm breaking this. No, thank you. I need to do this differently, I think. Huh, okay, wait, you can build this into the ground, which would actually make things a lot better. Okay, let's say we build that there, and then we're gonna want another one in the opposite direction, maybe even on all four sides. Okay, there we go, that's that front gate complete. And then we would want to just use walls, and we just extend this. And I need more wood, so I'm gonna go chopping trees. Okay, I've gotten about, uh, what, four stacks of wood, which means 120 in this game. So that should be pretty good to keep us going with building our walls up. Whoops, I'm going pretty far. Probably want to turn around here. Bam. So that theoretically right there means that the wall is done. And I know it's not even, but you, you guys are going to have to deal with that, okay? We are theoretically fully walled off against anybody. That is nice. Okay. And village upgrade. Boom. Perfect. Back in my world, they call me Groom, but you can call me Rowan around here. If you need anything, I'll be here. Do, do, do. Butter me up. Call me a biscuit. It's a new friend. I'm exhausted from digging dirt all day. I'll sleep at your village tonight. So it looks like this is somebody that's good at digging dirt. Here we go. Live in my village. Yes. 
Perfect. I think, you know, what would be useful is literally making like a warehouse where we can just store all of our stuff. Oh, look at that bungalow. That's going to require a lot of materials, but I'm also kind of down with uh, building a bungalow, you know? We can give this little cabin here to our friends, or we can just treat it as a second house for ourselves and just be rich. It does look like we're going to need a bunch more granite, though, so we need to go mining for that. Okay, now we are looking for granite, but I did just hear the supply drop. I don't know if it'll drop by itself. I don't have my crossbow on me, do I? Oh, I do, but I don't have any arrows. Oh, hello, beautiful. What do we got? Ow. Okay, some okay items. It looks like slurp juice. I don't really need much else. Oh yeah, look at that. I changed my outfit. I'm on by nine nine now. Okay, I think I got enough granite. I got a whole ton. And over here, there should probably be a gate. So you know what? I'm gonna break this down. Boom, we're gonna place it like that. Oh, that should be perfect. Boom, now we have a second gate. Very nice. Okay, you know what? We might have to place it like this and then we'll place stairs up to it. Oh boy. Okay, building time. Bam. Oh, bungalow complete. Okay, now we do have to figure out how we're actually gonna get up here. Bam. Okay, it's definitely not perfect, but look at that. We kind of made it work. That likely means we should try to do the same on this side. Okay, there we go. We have another staircase. This works. Well, now that we have this huge space, storage should become a little bit easier for us. Okay, we're gonna break this bed. And I think what we'll do is we'll build some more in here so that this is where we can house everybody. And then the shed we can use for more construction things, right? So that'd be pretty nice. Okay, Rowan wants a job. Let's talk jobs. Help the village. Actually, never mind. Wait, what about exploring? Um, okay, wait. So can I not make you stop adventuring? Oh, dang. It. She's stuck adventuring with me now. <laughs> that was not on purpose. You know what? Maybe we should make more of these charming beds. So I'm going to make a bunch more planks. And we are going to place some beds here. One, two, three. And then my bed's going to be in my house over here. I almost feel like the green bed would work better with our house here. So that's what I'm going to use instead. Bam. Completely uncentered double bed. Edgy bookshelf. Look at that. Boom. One there. Oh, yeah. Looking good. And I'll have two tables. Oh, and then we need lighting. I can make uh, this like candle thing, but I'd rather have a lamp. I just need bright cores. Maybe we should go out and search for how to get these. And we also need to get granite slabs to upgrade our village, for which we need marble. All right, so we need to get marble and we need to adventure to find these bright core things, which I don't know where we find them. Look at this, it's like a pumpkin field over here. That's kind of fun. Okay, I got a bunch of pumpkins, so we should be good on food for quite a while now. Corn. Wow, there's just a lot of stuff around here. Thank you for, like, almost 60 corn. I'll take it. This looks to be a slightly bigger camp of enemies. I haven't seen one this big. And I don't really like using the shield, because I'd rather just have everything lit up, so that's what I tend to do. Snowberry shake plus 12 health. Pepper seeds. Okay, those are epic rarity. We'll take them. Oh, you are freezing. Oh, that's not good. Oh, I can throw down torches, but and this is also my last torch, I'm just realizing. Uh-oh. I don't know what to do. Help. No. Oh my goodness. You are cold. How am I cold again? No, 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 no. I see why. It's because of the snow biome over there. So we can't go anywhere there until we upgrade our heat sources, I guess. Oh, hello. Blue Squire, who are you? I've been battling brutes forever. I wish I could settle down in a nice village somewhere. Join my village. I don't want to join your village, at least not yet. It seems a little crowded. Well, then I'm going to have to rob you. All right. Nothing personal. Nothing personal at all. It's got another chest. I do see there's a cave and we did need marble, didn't we? So I guess let's uh, head into it. Hello. Here we go. This is what we need. Okay, wait, hold on. She said that if we go north, there's like a dry valley and we can find cactus there. So that's something to know. There are different biomes, which I didn't really think into. All right, and my pickaxe broke. So I guess it might be time to head back home. Okay, I'm back. I'm 
back. Okay, well, I'm indeed back with all this loot, but I have nowhere to put it. So let us definitely create a storage for ourselves. Um, I wonder if you can stack chests. No, it doesn't look like you can, unfortunately. The next best thing is just kind of putting them really close together and filling in the area like so. You know what? We should probably organize our chests, to be honest. Like, we should have a uh, kind of vegetable type of chest. So, yeah, I'm going to start organizing them. Folks, I'm uh, trying to organize here. So I have one for food. I have one for miscellaneous items, plants, wood, and stone. But, I mean, I'm already running out of story. It's pretty crazy. I'm hoping that we have more storage options as we level up, but if not, we're just going to have to keep on <laughs> building a mass amount of chests. And you know what? We should build the stone breaker, which we can put right here. Boom. And we need to make these granite slabs. And while that does its thing, I'm going to go and collect some more basic resources because I'm running low. these glowing thingies, which we should probably try to follow. Oh, we found a llama. Oh, there it is. This is what I was thinking of before. Pet. We pet the llama. Boom. What do we get from that? Dynamite. Okay. Wolf claw. Blast powder. Okay, that's it? That's it? You gave me dynamite? Are you kidding me right now? I mean, I guess it's better than nothing. I just don't know how I'm going to use this dynamite. Okay, let's pick these granite slabs up. And now that we've picked all that up, we should be able to upgrade village. Boom. And that gives us ready to rock villagers assigned to stone cutting will produce more stone types refined production villagers can be asked to smelt metal refine textiles and collect gems interesting collecting gems would be a cool one we got a bunch of new recipes including the grain mill grinds food down to their smallest elements and removes seeds from plants okay we got some rugs look at that a new bed oh yeah and new homes you know what i'm thinking maybe the next thing we should work on is upgrading our crafting bench because that'll give us even further tools and it looks like the main things we really just need are these sand claws and sand shells which are dropped by sand wolves and sand rollers and from what i heard if we go north that's where we'll find the desert biomes so i think we have to make a trip upwards which is going to be a bit dangerous and if we're going to do that we should take i think snowberries right because they will let us stay in the heat for long periods of time yes so we'll take that also snowberry shape other than that i can also craft a long sword look at that boom okay well shall we begin our mission i think we shall even though it's night time i will venture north I traveled for a while and I ended up running into just snowy biomes, which is uh, rather contrary to what I was looking for. And I did in fact go north. So yeah, I don't know. I'm going to try to go around this, but <laughs> that, this is definitely not what I was expecting. Uh, that's all I'm going to say. Oh yeah, here we go. Here we go. This is definitely desert uh, biome. So that's good. That means that we have reached the exact destination that I wanted to. Now it's just time to fight off the wolves and other creatures that are going to be here. You are hot. Oh, let me eat one of those. You know what we should do is, if we can, make a marker. Oh, I just need literally two gray night. Hold on. Well, anyways, I'm going to mark this down as desert. Oop, here we go. Oh, I think I hear some of the desert wolves. I don't know if that's going to be a good thing or a bad thing for us, but I'm going to approach this, whatever it is. Oh, that's not just Woohoo! <laughs> no. No, no, no. That's not a desert wolf, dude. No, no. No, 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 please. I don't want to. I don't want to make the trip all the way back here, please. Okay, I think I'm fine. I thought that was a wolf. Uh, that was bad. That's not what we want to happen. Oh, there we go. That's that's a desert wolf right there. Let's get it. Oh, and it just died to something else that we also might need to fight. Oh, look at its dodging skills. Gotcha. These guys don't seem to be dropping anything, though. Oh, boy. Oh, you want to get away from those explosions. I'm not... Oh, there we go. Sand claw. That's exactly what we needed. The other item was some kind of a shell, I feel like. Collect spicy pepper. Oh, yeah. It gives you cold resistance. That's exactly what I figured it would do. Awesome. We need those. Oh, and I've learned how to make a spicy burger. Interesting. Oh, here we go. This is what we needed. These guys are going to have the exact shells we need. Uh-oh. The two of them at once is not a great combo. There we go. We got them. Get them. Get them. Yeah. I 
feel like I see something up there that's glowing. Oh, I'm cold. Oh, oh, I'm cold now, aren't I? I wonder if we can check out what was up here. Let's try to staircase up, maybe. Oh, <gasps> no way. Is this gold? Oh my goodness. This is my first time seeing any material. Hold on. Is it actually gold, though? Oh, amber. Okay, well, still, it's a new, completely new material. That's awesome. Let's collect that. Looks like Rune needs a pickaxe. Do, 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 take this pickaxe. You're welcome. All right, well, I've run out of pickaxe. We just need some more of these sand shells mainly. Oh, it's finally daytime again. Whee! Oh, here we go. Hello. I did get everything we needed, so I feel like we should start returning home, which is a very long way, which is crazy. Oh, I see home. This has been a really long run. I am back. Okay, so now that we've got these, the sand shell and the sand claw, we need to get marble so that we can finish the crafting bench upgrade. So let us just go ahead and go into the cave that's near us. Okay, I've arrived in a cave. Let us get some of this marble real quick. Okay, I got uh, about two and almost a half stacks of marble, which I think should be enough. Now, we just have to put these into the machine here. And we wait. In the meantime, we can collect some of these crops. And I didn't realize that multiple would grow on one tree. That's pretty cool. Okay, let us collect that. And we should be able to do the bench upgrade. Boom. Look at that. Use crafting bench. Also, I just saw that we unlocked an upgraded chest, I think. Ooh, look at this. And also, we can now make a rare pickaxe, but we need flex wood, which I'm guessing can be found in that desert biome. Uh-huh. And cut amber we actually have, so we could make the upgraded axe if we want. And look at that. For the next upgrade, you need obsidian copper brute scale. Ooh, so we need to defeat a brute. Okay. Now, to get cut amber, we would need to use... A a gem cutter, which I think we can actually make. So it looks like we definitely need to go out and collect flex wood, first of all. I'm gonna craft myself up a couple more tools, and we're gonna have to head out again. I do wonder if flex wood is gotten in the desert or if it's gotten in the snowy biome, which maybe we should check out since we have the chilies now. Uh, they should keep us safe from uh, dying from cold. Let us adventure towards the mountains. <music> Oh, you're freezing. That is a sign for us to eat. These chilies. It does seem like I'm cold, but I'm not freezing. So I might be able to adventure through here. Yeah, because it says you are cold, but it doesn't say you are freezing. I'm curious as to if we can find anything unique to this biome here. There's these guys who aren't common. There we go. Is the wood here any different? No, that's regular wood. Oh, and there's a frost wolf. It one hit me. Oh, that's going to be so hard to get back. I did not realize. I think so. Yeah, that's definitely a stage that I'm not supposed to reach yet. I don't have any more peppers. So, I'm, I mean, I'm going to try to run in, grab my backpack and leave. I don't know if we'll be able to do that, though. We just got to run for it. Go, 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 go. Where is my backpack? No, 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 no. Stop. Stop it. There it is. Oh, no. Okay. Oh, well, that frost wolf got eliminated. Okay. Gimme, gimme, gimme. Yes. Perfect. Run, run, run. I'm not staying here. I'll pick that up. Arctic Claw, thank you. So let's uh, approach a cave in this biome. Oh boy, this wolf sees us. I honestly think it's a bad idea to fight the wolves right now. We do have more amber here, but I want to adventure into a cave. Okay, here's the cave. I think we should just head in here. Uh-oh. Oh, this is why I didn't want to come here last time. Right. So even if I eat the berry, that doesn't really help us, does it? Hold on. I'm still just hot. So, so far, that's okay. This is a bit scary. I'm just going off the fact that so far I am okay. 
<gasps> I can't break this? Okay, you know what? Oh, that's a bad idea. Definitely seems like if we want to come back here and take this on, we need the highest upgraded tools we can currently get. Now, I will say that it wouldn't be a bad idea to go into a generic cave and get some marble from there. So we can definitely do that. Okay, I think I'm good to head back. I've got about 60 marble in total, so we should be good to go. Okay, let's see, so tools. If we wanna make the blue tools, we need amber, and we also need sand claws. Oh, there's some rough amber. Okay, so I need silk threads. We can make those, no problem. And so to cut gems, we would need to build a gem cutter, and we're getting marble slabs for that now, boom. So that means we can build this thing. Question is, where do we wanna put it? Probably here, actually. There we go, gem cutter, perfect, cut amber, and we can start doing that. Okay, so I need more not root rods, that's hard to say, uh, to upgrade our village. But as for the tools, I'm making cut amber now. And then besides that, we can make this cool headed charm, that's nice. And I'll equip that in place of this one, there we go. Pick up our cut amber, and with that, we should be able to make a forest axe, boom. Awesome, so now we can collect the flex wood that we need. So, another very fun long trip, yay. Also, I'm curious, can we break this cactus? We can, what'll this give us? Let's see, oh, is that the wood we need? Flex wood, it is, okay. Oh, look at that, I can make a wheel. Oh, can I make like a car? That'd be pretty crazy, actually. Well, I'm trying to build up here. It's not going the best, but if I just place that, oh, okay, now I gotta break this. Oh, and we made it. Would you look at that? No problems at all. Oh, and I don't have any more pickaxes left. I did not realize that. To be fair, I did get most of what we needed. We can probably get a few more sand claws if we really want. Yeah, let's get that desert wolf over there and then we can leave. Okay, once again, I'm back home, and I'm wondering if uh, we're at a point where we can defeat the brute boss. Because if we can, I want to go for it. Okay, boom. Village upgraded. Villagers can gift unique recipes, though. And there's a whole new building we can build with, I think. We've done that, which is good. And we can make a pickaxe, a blue one. That lets us progress. I think we probably want to make an uncommon shield. And possibly even some of these blue health charms because in preparation for this brute, we can use all the health we can get. So I'm just gonna mass produce not root rods. It looks like they are in high demand. We wanna make more wool thread. Health charm. Looks like we can make two. I can probably even make a third. So that's gonna increase our health by a lot. I'm also making cords because we need that for the shield. And we need this drawstring to make the upgraded crossbow variants. Oh, here we go, drawstring. Okay, wait, so we just need cords to make the drawstrings, which we can definitely do. We should be able to make the upgraded shield. We can also make one more health charm. So now we have three of these fellas. Our health and defense are both increased significantly. And now we need a drawstring. Here we go, drawstring, and then if we go here, we can make the recurve crossbow. I'm kind of certain that we should just go for it and fight the brute. So we've seen a couple of them. I don't know exactly what dictates where they spawn or anything like that. We maybe can explore this direction here. Oh, I see one. Here we go. I'm gonna eat this up so I have extra stamina and let's go. Oh wow, that didn't hit him. There we go. Oh. Okay, now, while we can, we should probably try to use our sword, just because if this guy's easy, we'll fight another brute. Okay, I'm a bit scared. Okay, that's a bad attack. Attack, attack. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, that hurts. Okay, let's eat something. My companion died, just straight up. Take that and roll. Oh, that didn't work. That roll didn't work. Maybe we could have done a better job of using builds to take this guy out, but you know what? It's okay. Oh my goodness. Oh. Are you kidding me? Here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna use the crossbow for a bit because this thing works really well. Yeah, you definitely wanna use a mix of crossbow and sword on these guys. Okay, oh boy. And let's, oh, I took him out. Bam, destroyed. Oh, 
that went so much better than I thought it would. Now that's good news and all, but that's only one of the three brutes. Now, I do figure we should try, in this case, to fight the second brute, which is the desert one. I honestly have no idea how it's gonna go, though. Okay, we do need to stop by home if we wanna do this because we need to get the heat preventive food. It looks like there's desert over this way, which means I don't have to run a whole marathon to get to a desert biome. Anyways, let's head home and get these snowberries real quick. And I'm making one more drawstring so we can make an additional crossbow. Other than that, I'll just grab our cold-headed charm and snowberry shakes actually should do the trick. Boom, crossbow number two. Uh, it'll be better when it is daytime, but we can start heading towards the desert right away. Look at this. I ran into a huge ocean area. I don't know if you can make something to get across there, but we can't do that now. I I, I got kind of lost in the night. I'm not going to lie, but I'm also confused because I thought I saw a lot more desert than there actually seems to be. Maybe in that direction is where we should be heading. You know what? Before we fight anything, I will also top off our wood amount because that'll let us build in the middle of the fight if we have to. Okay, that is enough. Let's hopefully make it to the desert. Ooh, I see some interesting stuff over here. Yeah, let's quickly see if this has any special loot. Hello there, hello, hello. Now, is there any good loot here is the question. That's what we're here for at the end of the day. There is. Whoa, this is the best loot that I've ever gotten. We also got heavy wool, which is an epic item, it looks like. And then we got snowberries, five of them. That's pretty good. Okie dokie. I think we are safe to head into this desert section now. All right. Well, we're in the desert. Oh, that's a desert brute right there. Okay. I'll put a shield on. Let's just go for it. Get some shots on him for free. All right. I don't know if this guy has some different mechanics or not. Oh, well, he's scary. That's all I'm going to say. Just going to swipe at him from here. Oh, boy. Oh, you can't even jump over that. Okay. Good to know. Good to know. I'm not sure how we can use the shield with this guy because I don't know what attacks. Oh. <gasps> Oh, it blocks his basic attacks. Oh, that's so nice. Two hits. Oh, my sword broke. Okay, okay, okay. New sword, perfect. I'm just gonna arrow this guy for a bit. Okay, couple free hits again. Dodge and shoot. Oh boy, oh boy. Eat, eat. Oh, that's so bad. Corn is so much better. Oh my god. Okay, are you serious? I was so close. Okay, well, we'll just return. We literally had him at such low health. Oh, is that it there? I don't see the brute. I kind of hope that it didn't go anywhere because it was at like one HP. Okay, there we go. Yeah, I don't know. I don't see it. It's possible that it has left, which means we need to find another one. I wonder if that's the same brute. No, it's a different one. Okay, it's fine. We're going to beat this guy. We have to be careful with our arrows. And I do need to equip my shield, don't I? Um. Oh, that hit me. Oh my god. Uh, okay, we're going to defeat this brute once and for all. Oh. What is that that I hear? Oh, there's a brute. Okay, we're just gonna go get it. I'm gonna crossbow it a lot now because honestly, we have nothing to lose. You know what? This might just work. Just this. Oh, all right. Wow. He's just about gone. Maybe I'm gonna go in for a sword hit. Otherwise, it just doesn't feel satisfying at all. Got him. Bam. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, I'm returning to our village. Okay, <laughs> we did it. I mean, we built a nice village that's all surrounded with protection. We explored a bunch and geared up our character and we defeated two of the final three brutes. If you guys want to see me defeat the third one, let me know. Uh, leave a like, comment, subscribe. Once again, a huge thank you to Epic Games for sponsoring this video. You can check out LEGO Fortnite now using the link in the description.